Social media use is so prominent that many of us are on it daily. What kind of a social media user are you? Are you constantly connected? Do you post frequently or are you simply observing? Or maybe you just check your accounts every few days. Early research on Twitter shows that the average user may post updates to his or her account every few days, whereas more frequent users, who might use Twitter as a microblogging platform, may be updating it several times a day. In 2015, a study of doctoral students' use of Twitter reported similar results with regard to the distribution of tweets per day. They found that about 18% of users regularly used Twitter and 45% used it occasionally. The rest used it rarely or not at all. While these results indicate some diversity in the frequency of overall tweeting activity among scholars, they assume a constant level of social media activity over time and do not explore changes in the frequency of social media use among individual scholars. Think about your own social media use. Are there times when you are more engaged, maybe participating a little bit more, and other times when you take a step back from social media? A big hurdle that scholars face, just like we all do, is time management. We all have many tasks to accomplish within limited time, and this may compound into time-related stress. One response to time concerns has been for individuals to temporarily disengage from social media. Though a number of terms have been used to describe this phenomenon, like digital sabbatical and digital detox, it is essentially a withdrawal from social media for a period of time. While there is limited research on this topic, some reports suggest that scholars may temporarily disengage from social media for a variety of reasons, such as their need to reevaluate use, wanting to reclaim their time, or to address a variety of other personal or professional concerns. As scholars and universities continue to encourage faculty to participate in social media, taking social media breaks becomes an important phenomenon to understand. Although some of these breaks are related to time concerns, there are a number of other reasons why scholars disengage from social media, such as privacy concerns, mindful social media use, or lack of comfort with platforms. If we understand why and when scholars are disengaging from social media, we are in a better place to understand the forces that impact online activity and participation. Thanks a lot for tuning in. If you liked this research short, please share it with your friends, colleagues, and students.